just getting the light out here in Abu Dhabi at the Casa O'Brien. And I've made coffee this morning and I'm the only one up. The light is just starting to emerge this morning. It's a beautiful morning. So far I really haven't heard the birds banging out their songs yet, but uh, I'm sure that will come with relative quickness. Uh, I love early mornings. Um, I'm a morning person. I don't know if it's just because everything starts over again and you can have another redo one more day or just the fact that most people are still sleeping and I'm enjoying the quiet. But, uh, mornings are pretty cool. Plus you get a good cup of coffee. How can you even beat that? You know, and it's kind of freaky. Um, early this week, my son turned 14. And uh, maybe that's a milestone, maybe it's not. But I can remember 14 years ago, after my son was uh, born, going out in the parking lot, staring at the sky, going, oh my word, life has changed. It certainly has, but uh, it's been kind of cool. Um, just lots of milestones for him. I'm watching him, you know, I remember just a little while ago, he was uh, one of the first things I remember, um, not first things I remember, uh, but uh, when he learned to walk, <clears throat> I remember telling Jennifer that uh, I would see his, the tops of his hands as they grasped the top of the table. You wouldn't see his head, you wouldn't see anything. All you saw was a pair of hands you know, little fingers and knuckles just grasping onto the table so he could stand, you know, and that was one of our first really great long-term memories of, of development for a kid. Um, before that, I can recall we let his hair grow for an entire year. And uh, we were going to cut it on his first birthday, and I remember right before that we were at a restaurant and someone came up to me and said, your daughter is so pretty. You know, and I kind of got the scowl on my face and went, son. You know, so I was really happy when he got his hair cut. <laughs> on his first birthday, he turned out to be a real handsome character. Um, he's a good kid. <laughs> Yeah, bomb your sister. No. Bomb her. Why do you keep doing it that way? Dad, you look dumb. It looks kind of dumb. My daughter says I look dumb. It's amazing how kids are different. I mean, Richard is, if you look at his bedroom, it's really orderly. Everything is, is nice. He's kind of got a little OCD streak in him, and I'm kind of happy about that. Um, his sister, on the other hand, um, if you go in her bedroom, it looks like a grenade has been launched. Uh, the girl takes after me. What's well, the next day? I'm still drinking coffee. Um, I lost the video <laughs> clip that ended up that particular um, thing that I was doing in the morning, so I figured I'd I'd finish it up this morning. Um, just uh, it was a great morning. Uh, had a little, you know, had a little coffee, sat down, had some quiet time, and then actually I went uh, and got some exercise and started the day right, and had a full day of um, taking care of things around the house and uh, ironing. I do a lot of ironing. Uh, on that note, I uh, just want to tell everybody one last thing. <laughs> Keep on keeping on. Have a great day.